welcome back to another video. Today is a very exciting day, a very busy day, a very bittersweet day because today is my final day at home before I head off to my second contract. So if you are new here, I work on a cruise ship. I'm a figure skater, so I perform for the guests and I finally get to return to work. I do have a couple other vlogs if you wanna check those out all about prepping and getting ready to leave, but today is my final day at home and I've got a lot to get done today. I am currently in like quarantine because I got my PCR test I think two days ago and it came back negative, but I'm required to stay home up until my flight tomorrow. So my parents are working all morning and afternoon, so I have the house to myself to get everything done, get myself organized, and yeah, just kind of do my last minute things. So I've got this list. I wrote out all the things that I needed to get done today. So clearly there's a lot on the agenda, and then there's a few other miscellaneous things that I did not write down. I just can't believe that I leave tomorrow because I've been waiting for this day for so, so, so long since March 2020. So I'm just very grateful for the opportunity. And also I have been unbelievably stressed the last few weeks trying to get everything together and sorted out in time. So I've been kind of running around like a maniac and yeah, I'm just ready to go. I did show this in my previous vlog, but my cousin actually gifted me a portable steamer, which I'm so excited about and definitely gonna be bringing with me. So I'm gonna unbox this and throw it on in the suitcase. I've literally been wanting one of these for a while. Never thought to buy it for myself, so she read my mind. I don't know, should I bring the instructions? Since I don't know what I'm doing. Who's calling me? Hello? Hi mom. It's so small, it's so cute. In the suitcase we go. Alrighty. There you go, little guy. You can put that right in there. Good to go. I did lay out my clothes for the airport just because I don't want to have to think about that at 3 in the morning. So, they're ready to go. I pulled a few headscarves and a few headbands that I want to pack. And I also am bringing this purse. So, I'm going to put everything into the purse just to save some space and then put this in my suitcase. So I made my bed, uh, packed my hair stuff, worked out, exported that video. So I've got to put my laundry in the dryer and then I think I might wash my makeup brushes and print my paperwork. A whole bunch of makeup brushes I need to clean. These haven't been done in quite some time, so this is long overdue, and I feel like now is a good time to do it. So let's get to it. They're all done, now I'm just gonna lay them out to dry for a bit, but they look so much better. I have not done that in forever. I'm just now realizing that I never 
packed any perfumes. I definitely want to pack this one. This is my favorite scent at the moment from Dossier. I will have a coupon code if you guys are interested. I am in love with all of my Dossier perfumes. Clearly I have a bunch. All of these with the circle caps, those are all Dossier. But this scent is my absolute favorite and it's still pretty full so I'm going to pack this. And then I have to pick out one that's also pretty full because this is one of my all-time favorite perfumes, but it's at the end, so it's kind of a waste to bring. Then maybe I'll bring this one. I literally had to change into a tank top and some shorts because I'm working up a sweat in this house. Basically, I've gotten every single thing done and I tried to weigh my suitcases. They're quite heavy. They're both almost 50 pounds, but they're right under, so I should be good. I'm still all by my lonesome, but my mom should be home soon. Hi, babe. <laughs> Last night at home, on to the new adventure. In the building. Brett is in the building. I have a brother, people. <laughs> tip of the hat? I like that. He gave her a tip of the hat. <laughs> We've got some champagne from last night. La Marca, only the best. There we go. No, you were the tea and then you were in a special... Oh, the clinic? Yeah, yeah. The clinic. That's continuous because. Oh. Give me a drum roll. Next semester. That's the crazy one. Okay. Next semester. Woo! Next semester. You did pretty good at that. Um, oh, and I just found this out. I have to find a firm or an organization or something in the next. Like, I didn't know about this, and I have to also do that at the same time. We have to have like our whole and then prepare with him. Sure. Thanks, man. Mom and I will have the most, as usual. <laughs> Cheers! Cheers! Cheers, Dad. Hello, Jordan. Goodbye, Jordan. I like your glasses. I don't know, I sort of look funny. Dad, you always look funny. You kind of look like you belong in Devil's Wear Pro Devil Wears Prada. <laughs> oh, hi. How are you? Nice to see you again. I'm excited to go on a new ship to see you. <laughs> and all your new she's, friends are going to make. She's more excited to vacation than she is. No. Just kidding. No. I'm kidding. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. It is now like 10 o'clock Saturday night, and I need to prep for bed because I have to wake up like 3.30 tomorrow for my flight. So I'm going to end the vlog here. <sighs> I'm a little bit like, I don't know. I'm not emotional, but it just, it's really hitting me now. Finally, I think it hasn't hit me fully till this moment because I've been so worried and so caught up in the planning of everything and making sure that everything goes smoothly leading up. So now it's like really soaking in that I'm actually leaving. I love you guys to the moon and back. Thank you for all these sweet messages and comments and support. It does not go unnoticed, truly. My heart feels so full and I am just so thankful. So I hope you all have a great rest of your day or night whenever you're watching this. And I will just see you in my next one. Bye guys.